YouTube, Zookeeper here. So the repair today on the 2004 Subaru Forester, you know, uh, it's kind of unfortunate, but it has an oil leak. And uh, there you can see the oil drip on the filter. Uh, this vehicle was serviced uh, a couple weeks ago, and I noticed uh, my daughter had been complaining of oil. You can see oil carrying back um, behind the tray. And uh, so I did some research, and uh, based on previous experience and the information I was able to g gain on the internet, uh, this is commonly due to this leaking filter. Uh, I'm sorry, oil cooler O-ring. Some people have said you can take an O-ring off an oil filter. Um, a couple experts who worked for Subaru said, nope, you need to get the correct O-ring. The uh, filter O-ring might be the same diameter, same material, but it's not the same durometer or thickness, in other words, stiffness or thickness, so it's likely to blow out or cause a worse leak. So, the first thing I have to do is remove the fasteners and hold this guy in place. And there's one here. Going across, one here, over here, and back here. I need to get this tray off um, so that we can access the oil filter and oil cooler. So instead of doing a video on how to take the tray off, I'm just going to, uh, that's what I have to do next in order to replace the 2137 Zero Kevin Apple 001 oil cooler o ring 2004 Subaru Forester.